Just couldn't untie his feet quick enough there to, to control it and to make something else happen in the box, but a good little chance there. Here's Kelly. Kelly's been lively early on. And onside here on the right-hand side is Gareth McCreary who's beaten the offside track. Graben's in the centre. Oh, it's hit the post from Brentford, but it's scored on the rebound. And it's John Swift with the goal. It's his eighth of the season for Reading. Their goal's been coming. And in the 22, 22nd minute, it's Reading 1, Brentford 0. I'm saying, you know what, I'm going to definitely get something out of this phase. Here comes the corner, corner now. It's a short one to the near post. Here's Swift. Swift back to McCleary again, sets the ball up to the far post, there's a free header there and it's over the bar from Liam Moore and that should have been the second goal. Mm. Yeah, they've kind of got back into it, we've had some opportunities to get down our left-hand side and put them under trouble, hold up, Canos. Ball's given away here, oh, here is Canos, Canos, he's into the box now, he's gone past Gunter, chance for Sergi Canos, back to Fibé, Fibé's shot is blocked ah. and then the Naris had a brilliant chance and down to his left-hand side, El Habsi saved it. Fire that back to Hotter, but he goes short to Maxi Colon first of all. Reading all of a sudden under some pressure. Maxi Colon plays his high to the far post. He headed across by Bielend, headed up in the air. Here's Canos, Canos across the box. He's taken a deflection and it's gone behind for another corner. Reading. I think that's going to be the theme for the second half. Lassie Vibe. Oh, he's given the ball away, but it's one back by McKechnie, edge of the box. McKechnie, lovely ball through to Hossa, real chance for Hossa, he's dragged it wide ah. and Canos can't get there. It's all Brentford here and they're spurning chance after chance. Now he's McCleary drifting away from the edge of the box, goes back to Moore, a few groans from the Reading fans. Now it's out to this near side to Kelly, Brentford win it back though. Vibe linking up well with Woods, Woods into the path of McKechnie. McKechnie's got Memphrey on the right-hand side. Sergi Canos has switched over to the right side. Comes in field, tries to help it to uh, his fellow Spaniard Hotter. It's cleared away by Reading, but picked up by Woods. Now here's Maxim Colin on the right hand side. It's Nico Yanaris. Drills the ball across. There's a header. Oh, oh Lassie Vibe. He's four yards out with a free header. Liam yeah. Kelly charging forward. He lost control at the last minute. Oka comes. Maxim Colin and uh, finds Hotter on this left hand side. Here's Canos. Brilliant turn by Canos. Lovely ball inside to Hotter. They're linking up beautifully. Hotter, back to Canos, edge of the box, Canos, try oh, he was pushed the there, surely. Well, that looked like a push in the, the back three. by much on Canos, and Keith Stroud doesn't give anything. That looked a penalty. I've disowned him at the moment. Here's Canos on the left-hand side, gets the ball again from field, still with it, Canos into the box, Sergi Canos onto his right foot, Tries to create a chance to cross, goes for the near post, it's a side netting, it's gone behind. Brent more or less finished off in the same vein without creating too many chances, but I feel Brentford are going to keep up in the tempo and get back in this game. Here's Gareth McCleary down the left-hand side, the ball stayed in play, he's played it just to the outside of the box and Ryan Woods was there, he's being fouled there clearly by much. And he looks to take this quickly and he does to Hotter. Hotter looks to spin, gets it out quickly to Joseph Hoons. First chance for him to show his pace. He's going to take on McCleary. He's charging down that left-hand side. Drills the ball back. Here's Hotter. Yes! yes! The equaliser comes in the 63rd minute. And it's Hotter. And it's an instant impact from the substitute. Uh, Hotter's uh, third of the season. Oh, McEachern, another fantastic challenge there by Josh McEachern off. March, oh, brilliant. Referee. Oh, he's toying with him. <laughs> that is brilliant. Oh, that was like the big kid in the playground and the little kid in the playground, except the little kid was running rings around. He was won the ball back, <laughs> and then the big kid can't get it back off him without fouling it. He's now the game's up. turned around. Like he's pulled up with something there, Josh. What yeah, a ball. He has all ball straight ball. through to Fibé, Fibé in the box here, chance. Surely he'll score here, and yeah! he's yeah! <laughs> Brentford have turned it around, 66 minutes been. gone, and Lassie Vibe scores again, it's his seventh of the season. He's got to make that impact, he's got to keep going, and if we're then attacking with two pacey wingers on either side, what are Reading going to do? Reading look like they've lost their, uh, lost their legs. Yeah. Throw quickly from Reading to Kermigant, who's come deep, and a lovely ball over the top for McCleary. And they've got players in the box, and he's played across, and there's the equaliser. And it's Williams with the goal. It's two apiece here. And Maxine Cullen heads it on. Tyler Blackett wraps his foot around, gets up field, but Harley Dean, strong header. Now Vibe tries to turn his mouth. Oh, if Vibe got to the next ball, he would have played in Joseph's foot. 
breaks down the other end. Bentley races off his line. Oh, he's not got enough of that. The goal is free. Oh, this is going to be a third for Behrens. Oh, mistake by Bentley at the back. And the ball's played back across field and Behrens scores from five yards out. I, I, I totally agree with you on that. I don't think they deserve to be in the lead. Well, the it's three substitutions have made a, a big difference. Kermigan uh, linking up well. Getting a ball out to McCleary here. They go down the left-hand side. Behrens again is going to take on Dean. Crosses it to the far post. And uh, Field just gets a touch. Really good defending from Tom Field. Now here's Janaris. He's looking for options. Plays a really good ball into the path of Josephson. Now Josephson's through here. He can score the equaliser. He's hit it too early. Can he score for a touch? Oh, oh, no! For a goal. Just missed the post. Oh. Uh, what would be the second 3-3 in... Uh, Two games, this ball into the box, there's Josephin, Charles here for the third, Lassie Vibe has gone tight, oh. he's still with it, Vibe in the box, still with it, plays it across, that's going to be cleared by Reading. Oh, how is that not a goal again?